here, I gotta take this video. Look, Kevin. Look. Daddy! What? Daddy! Daddy! You happy now? Uh -huh. Okay. Daddy! <laughs> Mom, you say you got a good four day. <laughs> Daddy! Daddy! <laughs> you ready? Yeah. Are you ready? Yeah. Oh, yeah, tell me what.
Lieutenant Joshua tonight will be his sister, Army Specialist Stephanie Patterson. Mia, there you You see him? No. I see him, I see him. Go, Bella. Well, you better hurry up. You <laughs> tonight, one local woman had no idea her husband was coming home early from serving overseas on his fourth tour, but we did. Watch who's Talitha Vickers was there for this fantastic moment. I was holding my breath for this one because Staff Sergeant Michael Nardone set up a plan to surprise his wife at the very hospital where she works by posing as a trauma patient. Not your typical homecoming, but I tell you what, he set up this plan and pulled it off to perfection, leaving everyone in tears. U.S. Air Force Staff Sergeant Michael Nardone didn't waste a moment after stepping off an international flight from Germany geared up for a surprise mission to catch his wife off guard on the job inside the ER at Holmes Regional Medical Center. Uh, the night before, I didn't really sleep because I was excited about coming home, so uh, of course, uh, just can't wait to see her. Up on a hospital bed and under the sheets, Sergeant Nardone waits for his wife, who's an ultrasound yeah. tech. They haven't seen each other for seven months, and she's got no idea that her husband's tour of duty ended earlier than expected. All she knows is that a patient is waiting for an emergency procedure. And like her husband, she's ready to serve. But then... Uh, Mark I'm really happy. I'm really shocked. I wasn't expecting it at all. The tearful homecoming mission is complete, and the family, including their four year old Isabella and 22 month old William, will be reunited. What do you think the kids are going to say when they see you? They're, they're going to, well, that's going to be a whole nother. Whole nother thing because they're probably going to be asleep by the time we get home. But I'm usually not good at surprises, so I, I think this was a little bit better. So uh, everybody got involved, and uh, really, uh, thanks. Thank you, thank help. you all. Yes. Quite an embrace. Staff Sergeant Michael Nardone was not supposed to return home until August 20th. He has been deployed four times since getting married to his wife Leah in 2006, but he says this was hands down by far the best homecoming salute that he has ever been able to give his wife. Reporting from Brevard, Talitha Vickers, West 2 News.
Job well done. Mission accomplished right there. He's taking a picture of us. What do you think? Okay. What might be on here? Birthday cake? Birthday cake for Weston? Maybe, maybe. No, not I know Weston's birthday. Um, it's um the the flag cake with the decorations with mm, red, white, and blue. I don't know. It's Vanessa, a flag. What Vanessa, what do you think? Uh, it's the flag. Yeah, it's the Okay. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> 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 